Yo, what's going on, guys? It's Houston Sports Talk back in the video today, and we're going to be talking about if the Houston Texans should sign Baker Mayfield, um, quarterback for the Carolina Panthers, who was released today after only starting six games this season, was supposed to be the starting quarterback, um, had a couple injuries, and he played seven games, started six games, and the Panthers decided to waive him as Darnold has started to play good in his first start. Um, it's a shame to see what's happened to Baker in the last couple of years um, with the Browns letting him go uh, and and what has happened with the Panthers. He has been waived, and um, someone can claim him. Anybody can claim him. He doesn't have to sign to a deal. Anybody can claim him. And because the Texans have the worst record in the NFL, the Texans are the number the number one team on the waiver board. So the Texans, the Texans have a shot to get him. Um, Lovey Smith, head coach for the Houston Texans, was asked about this today. Um, he said that you know he's he doesn't know a lot about Baker Mayfield, and but they'll consider anybody who is on that waiver board, and they're they're going to look into it. Um, now, is this a good fit for the Texans? Now, the the Texans were looking at getting Baker Mayfield in a trade back when the Texans and Browns were discussing a trade for Deshaun Watson in the summer. Um, Baker Mayfield was not a part of that Houston Texans Browns Watson trade, and um, now that we are we are mid season, the, the and uh, Baker has been traded to the Panthers. And now he's been cut. Do the Texans look look at uh, look go after him? You know, look. My question is, what happens to Mills or Kyle Allen? Is it, I I think it's rare to see three quarterbacks on a roster. Um, and you know, does one of those guys get cut? That's that's one of the things. I don't think the Texans would cut Mills. So then you have to see Kyle Allen get cut. Um, is Baker Mayfield worth it by getting Kyle Allen cut? I don't know. Kyle Allen did not look good in Houston's game against the Browns on sun on Sunday, and he he, he didn't look. He was he fumbled twice. He he threw two interceptions. He just looked really bad. Um, was through a lot of incompletions, overthrows. Um, so you know, I wouldn't mind the Texans. I think Baker Mayfield would be a better fit for the Texans than Kyle Allen would. Uh, the season in six games for the Panthers, or seven games of six starts for the Panthers, Baker has 1,300 yards thrown, six touchdowns, six interceptions, and has fumbled three times. Um, the turnovers, that, that, that's not a good thing that I see, but I see a real struggling Panthers team. Uh, now, the Texans are not good either. But I think Baker Mayfield would be decent on the Houston Texans. I think Baker could be better than Kyle Allen's been. But, you know, to be honest with you guys, I really don't think this is the move for the Texans, uh, even though I think Baker Mayfield would be on the Texans. I think what the real move is that the Texans need to make is put Mills back in. I think Kyle Allen should have been benched on Sunday against the Browns. Um, and I don't know why it didn't happen. I don't know why Mills did not get put in. It's the last two games with Kyle Allen's performance in the first half against the Dolphins and Kyle Allen's performance in the second half against the Browns. You know, both of those times, I'm thinking, like, Lovey, why are you not putting in Davis? And, you know, I feel like it's – and don't get me wrong, but if it's not, but I feel like part of the reason why he's not putting in Davis is because, you know, if he puts in Davis and says – and then he's then he's kind of looking like he was wrong for benching Davis Mills. And not only is his job already in jeopardy, um, but th I think that would put his job in a little bit more of jeopardy if he puts D Mills back in after benching him because they thought the better fit was Kyle Allen, and then Kyle Allen wasn't, and then they put M Mills back in. I think that's just a bad look as a head coach, and uh, his job's already in jeopardy because of the team's record and the way they play. Uh, so I, maybe that's why, but I Kyle, Kyle Allen looks so bad. I don't know why they didn't put Mills in in the first half against the Dolphins or the second half against the Browns. But let me know what you guys think about potentially signing Baker Mayfield. I'd rather just let the Texans, instead of doing that, instead of claiming Mayfield, the Texans, what they should do is put Mills back in as the starter. I know he's not that good, but he's way better than Kyle Allen. And um, that, that should be the move um, for the Texans, but we'll see. That's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know your thoughts and peace out. Go Texans.